Really? You made me go through that entire thing just to show me, like, a brief flashback? Lame! Another vision the Opera Ghost was to be paid his dues. 20,000 francs be delivered monthly to Box 5. Or, and Box 5 to be reserved at all times. Yep, well. He must have been hiding behind the mirror. Perhaps there's a way out beneath the stage. Maybe. This is disturbing. <laughs> Someone was using this place to spy on people. Well, I think we know who. I found a note written by Joseph Bouquet, the stagehand, and in it he describes seeing a man lurking in the caverns below the opera house despite his own amb ambivalence. Joseph had plans to expose the man. Oh, got a bottle. Anything else? Honey, you obviously don't know how humans work. Hey, humans are disturbing. They're freakish and psychotic and weird and... The stagehand thought he could capture me? His curiosity was his undoing. Yep, curiosity killed the cat and all that. I know. A useful hook, but it won't budge. Well, okay. Another one of these... Can canopic jars! That's what I'm... No, that wasn't it. Was it? Yes, it was. What's this? A bit of an ant problem. I think that there's a bit of an insect problem, period. And we'll just scoop up the ants. Get a jar of ants. Just like the bee throwing. Looks like a jack-in-the-box. Why are all the di dolls just like blinking and... Ugh! No! You should never have left me. Well, maybe you should have, I don't know, kept a better hold on me. Or tried a different approach. Or, you know, anything other than kidnapping and murdering. Oh boy. Let's see. Yeah, some of these actually just hurt my eyes with how painful all the detail is. I had respect to those who drew this and painted it, but... Damn, did you have to? Oh, that just got really quiet. I'm not used to the music and the ambient sound going away. Oh, magnet. The devil. Oh, handsaw. Suitcase. Termites. Another canopic jar. A screw. A moth. Mothy moth? Mothra. Pocket watch. And a pulley. Termites? That's a yo yo. Nope. That's. I'm assuming that's a baster. Hmm. Um. Oh, a funnel and a. Oh, we do need a cigar. Okay. A funnel. Holy pocket watch and the devil. Found him. There's a pulley. Pocket watch and a moth. You know, I've actually learned a lot about objects from games like these. And I'm like, oh, so that's the name of that object. Or some weird otherworldly thing. And I'm like, oh, well, that's a thing. Especially like some of the older games, like the Mystery Case Files. One of which is my favorite. I haven't actually finished one of those yet. I should do that. As a let's play. Found in the pocket watch. Yeah, no, I've. <laughs> just like reading books and you find a new word and you're like, what the heck is that word? <clears throat> Alright, let's see. A moth. What's it look like? Oh, it's just a flat, regular old moth. Alright, let's use a hint. Oh. Well, okay. Another canopic jar. They all must go somewhere. Oh, I thought... Oh, I didn't... Oh. I wonder what I'm supposed to make of this. Apparently I don't have enough. I didn't mean to go that way yet. I was still looking around. Anything else? No. Okay. What do you want? Oh. Alas, poor York, I knew him well. Oh, great. We need a skull. 
To be or not to be, that is the question. They must have been performing Hamlet here at some point. I saw this play with my mother years ago. Oh, well, okay. Stop doing that. There's a thing. Well, wait a minute. Stop clicking. Okay. The gears are all gummed up. Well. Thank you, ants. Thank you. Oh. Well, guess we're missing something. Thankfully, we got a crank! What's gonna come out? We gotta clip the bear's claws. Okay, that was adorable. Okay, thanks, man. Yep, you're great. Just gonna... Just gonna go. Alright, I believe that's all of these. Come on. Okay. Hmm. Oh! Great! Uh... Let's see. I guess that's, uh, C. Um... Oh god, this is worse than a word search. And then... A... Yeah, that's A, right? Yeah. Okay, um... in a dot. There's not that many stars in the board. Stars. Usually I'm really good at word searches too. That's not correct. Um... Star, star... Stars... That's B. And B has to... Found it! Alright, second down is... E. E. So, two of these... Next to a hangman... There. And then one down is D. Hangman, I in a star. Yep, this one. Alright, and then F. Hangman, triangle. There you are. Devotion and bring me another black rose. Dude, I don't love you. I'm just doing this to get out of here. I saw the opera ghost in the mirror again. What does he want? Another black rose? Well, he did just ask you <laughs> to find another black rose, so... Maybe there's uh, something interesting in here. I don't know. Maybe he wants one. I, cr I don't know. I honestly don't know how you could tell. <laughs> I need that. <clears throat> Let's see. What else do I need? A teacup, an Egyptian goddess. A symbol. The fool. A music stand. Um. Clarinet reed. It's a harmonica, not a reed. Gramophone. 
a mute. I don't know what a mute is. And a metronome. Metronome? Opera glasses. There they are. <coughs> a wombat. Is that it? No, it's not. Is that it? Yes, it is. An upside down teacup, I'm assuming? From the look of that? Uh, oh no, it's not. It's just on a saucer. Okay. Music stand. Clarinet reed. Uh. And a mute. I honestly. Is this a mute? Apparently it is. I have no idea what that is, but I guess it's that. And a clarinet reed. Alright, let's just use a hint because we can. Oh. <sighs> Some of these are so. The Egyptian god Horus. It's a beautiful stage piece. Oh, I guess let's. I'll just take that then. All right. Anything else interesting around here? That must be the auditorium. I am Don Juan Triumphant. <laughs> Another black rose. Is he trying to tell me something? Oh, sweetheart, you are just. Mm, you are just a genius. Flawless. Right. Oh, how'd that story go? Uh, nope. Before that. Alright, here we go. Let's see. Kobeshnev stood by his father's left hand. Uh, right. Happy standing to the left. Or the head of a baboon. Uh, we're sent to happy jackals. Standard and then over there is a Okay. Um. Okay. Fresh enough. Stood his father's left hand. Happy. Stood to the left. Uh, offered the head of a jackal. Jackal goes on the right. And then you go there, and we are done. Or not. Is that the way? No. Okay. Father's left hand. So, stood to the left. But then this is his left hand. So... Oh god, I hate this puzzle so much. I can never remember how it's supposed to go. Okay. Up at the head of a jackal. And if you want to listen to the little thing to find out. I have a human, so these two can't be together. Does this go that way? Kovashnev goes my father's left hand. Okay, he's supposed to be there. Um, Happy is supposed to be on the left. I don't know how far left. And the MC who had nothing but will present the head of a human. For down the tiff. Okay, there we go. things. Let's go in here. Oh, lollipop. A cannon. A Templar knight. A whip. A shield. A sun disc. Magician's hat. If you blink at me, I swear I'm gonna... <sighs> a unicorn. Oh, found the magician's hat. A centurion helmet. Found a centaur. A dove. A noose. And found the shield. 
Doric column, I believe. Oh, kitty. Neck ruffle. Uh, Unicorn, a whip, and a noose. Centurion helmet. I thought I saw a unicorn around here somewhere. I gotta love it when I see something and then I go back and then I forget where I put it. Or where I seen it. There it is. A whip and the noose. There's a whip. Isn't that technically a cat of nine tails? And a noose. I don't know where the noose is. Oh, it's around someone's neck. The wrong way. The edges on this sun crust Found are it. worn. All right, let's it go. Must slot into something. Mm, maybe the thing where it looks like a sun disk should be. Just maybe. Mine. Give me. The angel of music is waiting for you. Could this be Joseph Bouquet? Did the opera ghost murder him? Oh, hon, you know nothing of your history, do you? <laughs> 